century. Noun. A period of 100 consecutive years. Often specifically a numbered period with conventional start and end dates. E.g. The 20th century. Which stretches from. Strictly. 1901 through 2000. Or. Informally. 1900 through 1999. The first century A.D. was from 1 to 100. Meta. Adjective. Self-referential. Structured analogously, but at a higher level. Shown. Verb. To display, to have somebody see. Something. Box. Noun. Senses relating to a three-dimensional object or space. Verb. To place inside a box. To pack in one or more boxes. Caregiver. Noun. A carer. Contains. Verb. To hold inside. Crackers. Noun. A dry, thin, crispy baked bread. Usually salty or savory, but sometimes sweet, as in the case of graham crackers and animal crackers. Adjective. Crazy. Insane. Certificates. Noun. A document containing a certified statement. Devoid. Verb. To empty out. To remove. Adjective. Empty. Having none of. Completely without. Hamster. Noun. Any of various old world rodent species belonging to the subfamily Chrysidini. Verb. To secrete or store privately. As a hamster does with food in its cheek pouches. Stairs. Noun. A single step in a staircase. Noun. A contiguous set of steps connecting two floors. Destiny. Noun. That to which any person or thing is destined. A predetermined state. A condition predestined by the divine or by human will. Flexibility. Noun. The quality of being flexible. Suppleness. Pliability. Frequently. Adverb. At frequent intervals. Mask. Noun. A cover. Or partial cover. For the face. Used for disguise or protection. Verb. To cover. The face or something else. In order to conceal the identity or protect against injury. To cover with a mask or visor. Reasonable. Adjective. Having the faculty of reason. Rational. Reasoning. Contentment. Noun. The state or degree of being contented or satisfied. Assist. Noun. A helpful action or an act of giving. Verb. To help. Begin. Noun. Beginning. Start. Verb. To start, to initiate or take the first step into something. Griddle. Noun. A stone or metal flat plate or surface on which food is fried or baked. Verb. To use a griddle. Cook on a griddle. Problem. Noun. A difficulty that has to be resolved or dealt with. Adjective. Of a person or an animal. Difficult to train or guide. Unruly. Provider. Noun. One who, or that which, provides a service, commodity, or the means for subsistence. Smiling. Verb. To have. A smile. On one's face. Noun. The action of the verb to smile. Adjective. That smiles or has a smile. Palm. Noun. Any of various evergreen trees from the family palmae or ericaceae. Which are mainly found in the tropics. Exploit. Noun. A heroic or extraordinary deed. Verb. To use for one's own advantage. Inputs. Noun. The act or process of putting in. Infusion. Verb. To put in. Put on. Silver. Noun. A lustrous. White. Metallic element. Atomic number 47. Atomic weight 107.87. Symbol ag. Verb. To acquire a silvery color. Adjective. Made from silver. Inspired. Verb. To infuse into the mind. To communicate to the spirit. To convey. As by a divine or supernatural influence. To disclose preternaturally. To produce in. As by inspiration. Adjective. Having excellence through inspiration. Jester. Noun. One who jests, jokes or teases. Headmaster. Noun. A male school principal. Permission. Noun. Authorization. Consent. 
especially formal consent from someone in authority. Verb. To grant or obtain authorization for. Legacy. Noun. Money or property bequeathed to someone in a will. Adjective. Left over from the past. No longer current. Statement. Noun. A declaration or remark. Simple. Noun. A herbal preparation made from one plant. As opposed to something made from more than one plant. Verb. To gather simples. I.e. medicinal herbs. Adjective. Uncomplicated. Taken by itself. With nothing added. Dusk. Noun. A period of time at the end of day when the sun is below the horizon but before the full onset of night, especially the darker part of twilight. Verb. To begin to lose light or whiteness. To grow dusk. Adjective. Tending to darkness or blackness. Moderately dark or black. Dusky. Prefer. Verb. To be in the habit of choosing something rather than something else. To favor. To like better. Shooting. Verb. To launch a projectile. Noun. An instance of shooting with a gun or other weapon. Freezing. Verb. Especially of a liquid. To become solid due to low temperature. Noun. The change in state of a substance from liquid to solid by cooling to a critically low temperature. Adjective. Suffering or causing frost. Confidence. Noun. Self-assurance. Competence. Noun. The quality or state of being competent, i.e. able or suitable for a general role. Awful. Adjective. Very bad. Adverb. Awfully. Dreadfully. Terribly. Posters. Noun. A picture of a celebrity. An event etc. Intended to be attached to a wall. Noun. A post horse. Florist. Noun. A person who sells flowers. Hobby. Noun. An activity that one enjoys doing in one's spare time. Standing. Verb. Heading. To position or be positioned physically. Adjective. Erect. Not cut down. Full. Adjective. Containing the maximum possible amount that can fit in the space available. Adverb. Fully. Quite. Very. Thoroughly. Completely. Exactly. Entirely. Programmatic. Adjective. Of. Or relating to a step-by-step -step program, especially a computer program. Dimensional. Adjective. Of or pertaining to dimensions. My. Interjection. Used to express surprise, shock or amazement. Run over. Verb. To exceed the allotted time. Illusion. Noun. Anything that seems to be something that it is not. Simplify. Verb. To make simpler. Either by reducing in complexity. Reducing to component parts. Or making easier to understand. Bow. Noun. A weapon made of a curved piece of wood or other flexible material whose ends are connected by a string. Used for shooting arrows. Verb. To play music on. A stringed. Instrument using a bow. Extraordinary. Noun. Anything that goes beyond what is ordinary. Adjective. Not ordinary. Exceptional. Unusual. Persons. Noun. An individual. Usually a human being. Verb. To represent as a person. To personify. To impersonate. Primitive. Noun. An original or primary word. A word not derived from another. As opposed to derivative. Adjective. Of or pertaining to the beginning or origin. Or to early times. Original. Primordial. Primeval. First. Confirmation. Noun. An official indicator that things will happen as planned. Blender. Noun. A machine outfitted with sharp blades. For mashing. Crushing or liquefying food ingredients. Seventh. Noun. The person or thing in the seventh position. Adjective. The ordinal form of the number seven. Odd. Noun. Diminutive. An odd number. Adjective. Differing from what is usual. Ordinary or expected. Soup. Noun. Any of various dishes commonly made by combining liquids. Such as water or stock with other ingredients. Such as meat and vegetables.
that contribute flavor and texture. Verb. To feed. To provide with soup or a meal. Anesthesia. Noun. An artificial method of preventing sensation. Used to eliminate pain without causing loss of vital functions. By the administration of one or more agents which block pain impulses before transmitted to the brain. Climb. Noun. An act of climbing. Verb. To ascend. Rise. To go up. Humbling. Verb. To defeat or reduce the power. Independence. Or pride of. Noun. An event which causes humbleness. A set down. Adjective. Of higher rank. Status. Quality. Strength. Etc. Inducing a feeling of inferiority. Verb. Of an animal. To remove the horns. To pull. People. Noun. Used as plural of person. A body of human beings considered generally or collectively. A group of two or more persons. Verb. To stock with people or inhabitants. To fill as with people. To populate. Noun. An individual. Usually a human being. Oranges. Noun. An evergreen tree of the genus Citrus such as Citrus sinensis. Verb. To color orange. Parliament. Noun. A formal council summoned, especially by a monarch, to discuss important issues. Remove. Noun. The act of removing something. Verb. To move something from one place to another. Especially to take away. Leader. Noun. Any person that leads or directs. Configure. Verb. To set up or arrange something in such a way that it is ready for operation for a particular purpose. Or to someone's particular liking. Eating. Verb. To ingest. To be ingested. Adjective. Bread to be eaten. Fourth. Noun. Not used in the plural. The person or thing in the fourth position. Adjective. The ordinal form of the number four. Inject. Verb. To push or pump, something, especially fluids, into a cavity or passage. Emission. Noun. Something which is emitted or sent out. Issue. Mental. Adjective. Of or relating to the mind or an intellectual process. Judgment. Noun. The act of judging. Besides. Adverb. Also. In addition. Preposition. In addition. In addition to. Format. Noun. The layout of a publication or document. Verb. To create or edit the layout of a document. Humidifier. Noun. A device that is used to increase the humidity of the air. Drugs. Noun. A substance used to treat an illness. Relieve a symptom. Or modify a chemical process in the body for a specific purpose. Verb. To administer intoxicating drugs to. Generally without the recipient's knowledge or consent. Noun. A drudge. Remind. Verb. To cause one to experience a memory. Of someone or something. To bring to the notice or consideration. Of a person. Injury. Noun. Damage to the body of a human or animal. Verb. To wrong. To injure. Organizer. Noun. A person who arranges the details of a public event. Report. Noun. A piece of information describing. Or an account of certain events given or presented to someone. With the most common adpositions being by. Referring to creator of the report. And on. Referring to the subject. Verb. To relate details of. An event or incident. To recount. Describe. Something. Immersed. Verb. To put under the surface of a liquid. To dunk. Adjective. Under the surface of a liquid. Sunk. Bundle. Noun. A group of objects held together by wrapping or tying. Verb. To tie or wrap together into a bundle. Verb. Often with, on. To jump into a dog pile. Renovate. Verb. To renew. To revamp something to make it look new again. Function. Noun. What something does or is used for. Verb. To have a function. Fall on. Verb. To experience. To suffer. To fall upon. Facts. Noun. Something actual as opposed to invented. Snack. 
Noun, a light meal. Verb, to eat a light meal. Melody. Noun, tune. Sequence of notes that makes up a musical phrase. Proceed. Verb, to move, pass, or go forward or onward. To advance, to carry on. Patch. Noun, a piece of cloth, or other suitable material. Sewed or otherwise fixed upon a garment to repair or strengthen it. Especially upon an old garment to cover a hole. Verb. To mend by sewing on a piece or pieces of cloth. Leather. Or the like. Disease. Noun. An abnormal condition of a human. Animal or plant that causes discomfort or dysfunction. Distinct from injury insofar as the latter is usually instantaneously acquired. Verb. To cause unease. To annoy. Irritate. Countless. Adjective. Too many to count. Innumerable or incalculable. Guilty. Noun. A plea by a defendant who does not contest a charge. Adjective. Responsible for a dishonest act. From. Preposition. Used to indicate source or provenance. Century. Noun. A period of 100 consecutive years. Often specifically a numbered period with conventional start and end dates. E.g. The 20th century. Which stretches from. Strictly. 1901 through 2000. Or. Informally. 1900 through 1999. The first century A.D. was from 1 to 100. Benefits. Noun. An advantage. Help or aid from something. Verb. To be or to provide a benefit to. Purification. Noun. The act or process of purifying. The removal of impurities. Belonged. Verb. To have its proper place. Environments. Noun. The surroundings of, and influences on, a particular item of interest. Attributes. Noun. A characteristic or quality of a thing. Verb. To ascribe. Something. To a given cause. Reason etc. Password. Noun. A word used to gain admittance or to gain access to information. Watchword. Verb. To protect with a password. Consequences. Noun. That which follows something on which it depends. That which is produced by a cause. Noun. An old-fashioned parlor game describing the meeting of a lady and gentleman and the ensuing events. Each player in turn writing a part of the story. Not knowing what the others have written. Did. Verb. Auxiliary. A syntactic marker. Conversations. Noun. Expression and exchange of individual ideas through talking with other people. Also. A set instance or occasion of such talking. Verb. To engage in conversation. With. Close. Noun. An end or conclusion. Verb. Physical. To remove a gap. Pile. Noun. A mass of things heaped together. A heap. Verb. Often used with the preposition, up. To lay or throw into a pile or heap. To heap up. To collect into a mass. To accumulate. Mistress. Noun. A woman. Specifically one with great control. Authority or ownership. Verb. Of a woman. To master. To learn or develop to a high degree of proficiency. Poses. Noun. Common cold. Head cold. Qatar. Noun. Position. Posture. Arrangement. Especially of the human body. Verb. To place in an attitude or fixed position. For the sake of effect. Verb. To ask. Someone. Questions. To interrogate. Insects. Noun. An arthropod in the class Insecta. Characterized by six legs. Up to four wings and a chitinous exoskeleton. Flirt. Noun. A sudden jerk. A quick throw or cast. A darting motion. Verb. To throw. Something. With a jerk or sudden movement. To fling. Adjective. Pert. Wanton. Detailed. Verb. To explain in detail. Adjective. Characterized by attention to detail and thoroughness of treatment. Nightmare. Noun. A demon or monster. Thought to plague people while they slept and cause a feeling of suffocation and terror during sleep. 
Doctors. Noun. A physician. A member of the medical profession. One who is trained and licensed to heal the sick or injured. The final examination and qualification may award a doctor degree in which case the post-nominal letters are DO, DPM, MD, DMD, DDS in the US or MBBS in the UK. Verb. To act as a medical doctor to. Mindful. Adjective. Being aware. Of something. Attentive. Heedful. Images. Noun. An optical or other representation of a real object. A graphic. A picture. Verb. To represent by an image or symbol. To portray. Ruler. Noun. A. Usually rigid. Flat. Rectangular measuring or drawing device with graduations in units of measurement. A straight edge with markings. Verb. To beat with a ruler. As a traditional school punishment. Blogger. Noun. A contributor to a blog, from weblog, or online journal. PM. Adverb. Afternoon. Used after a time to indicate it is between noon and midnight. I.e. In the afternoon. Evening or night as opposed to the morning. Adverb. After death. Civilizations. Noun. An organized culture encompassing many communities. Often on the scale of a nation or a people. A stage or system of social. Political or technical development. Characters. Noun. A being involved in the action of a story. Clear. Noun. Full extent. Distance between extreme limits especially, the distance between the nearest surfaces of two bodies, or the space between walls. Verb. To remove obstructions, impediments or other unwanted items from. Adjective. Transparent in color. Adverb. All the way. Entirely. Ecologist. Noun. A scholar of ecology. Cleaner. Noun. A person whose occupation is to clean floors, windows and other things. Does. Verb. Auxiliary. A syntactic marker. Command. Noun. An order to do something. Verb. To order. Give orders. To compel or direct with authority. Postponed. Verb. To delay or put off an event. Appointment etc. Adjective. Done later than originally planned. Delayed. Dirty. Verb. To make. Something. Dirty. Adjective. Unclean. Covered with or containing unpleasant substances such as dirt or grime. Adverb. In a dirty manner. Memorize. Verb. To learn by heart, commit to memory. Lasted. Verb. To perform. Carry out. Verb. To shape with a last. To fasten or fit to a last. To place smoothly on a last. Overwrite. Noun. The operation of destroying older data by recording new data over it. Verb. To destroy. Older data. By recording new data over it. Skyline. Noun. Earth sciences. The line at which the earth and sky meet. Verb. To outline something against the sky. Academic. Noun. Usually capitalized. A follower of Plato. A Platonist. Adjective. Belonging to the school or philosophy of Plato. Behavior. Noun. Human conduct relative to social norms. Peer. Noun. A look. A glance. Verb. To look with difficulty, or as if searching for something. Balcony. Noun. An accessible structure extending from a building, especially outside a window. Lifeguard. Noun. A bodyguard or unit of bodyguards. A guard of someone's, especially a king's, life or person. Slogan. Noun. A catch phrase associated with the product or service being advertised. Expensive. Adjective. Given to expending a lot of money. Profligate. Lavish. Fifth. Noun. The person or thing in the fifth position. Verb. To support something fifth. After four others have already done so. Adjective. The ordinal form of the number 5. Nearby. Adjective. Adjacent. Near. Close by. Adverb. Next to. Close to. Defective. Noun. 
A person or thing considered to be defective. Adjective, having one or more defects. Deputy. Noun. One appointed as the substitute of another. And empowered to act for them. In their name or their behalf. A substitute in office. Verb. To deputize. Lips. Noun. Either of the two fleshy protrusions around the opening of the mouth. Verb. To touch or grasp with the lips. To kiss. To lap the lips against. Something. Verb. To kiss. To smooch. Haired. Verb. To remove the hair from. Adjective. Having hair. Not bald or hairless. Personal. Noun. An advertisement by which individuals attempt to meet others with similar interests. Adjective. Pertaining to human beings as distinct from things. Caramel. Noun. A smooth. Chewy. Sticky confection made by heating sugar and other ingredients until the sugars polymerize and become sticky. Verb. To caramelize. Adjective. Of a yellow-brown color. Divorce. Noun. The legal dissolution of a marriage. Verb. To legally dissolve a marriage between two people. Begins. Verb. To start, to initiate or take the first step into something. Cut out. Verb. To refrain from. Doing something. Using something etc. To stop, cease. Doing something. Adjective. Well suited. Appropriate. Fit for a particular activity or purpose. Shoes. Noun. A protective covering for the foot. With a bottom part composed of thick leather or plastic sole and often a thicker heel. And a softer upper part made of leather or synthetic material. Shoes generally do not extend above the ankle. As opposed to boots. Which do. Verb. To put shoes on one's feet. Pandemic. Noun. A pandemic disease. A disease that affects a wide geographical area and a large proportion of the population. Adjective. Of a disease. Epidemic over a wide geographical area and affecting a large proportion of the population. Also. Of or pertaining to a disease of this nature. Coloring. Verb. To give something color. Noun. An act or process which applies color. Photographer. Noun. One who takes photographs, typically as an occupation. Agreements. Noun. An understanding between entities to follow a specific course of conduct. Expensive. Adjective. Given to expending a lot of money. Profligate. Lavish. Easier. Adjective. Comfortable. At ease. Adverb. In a relaxed or casual manner. Products. Noun. A commodity offered for sale. Progress. Noun. Movement or advancement through a series of events. Or points in time. Development through time. Powerful. Adjective. Having. Are capable of exerting power. Potency or influence. Adverb. To a great extent or degree. Statistician. Noun. A person who compiles, interprets, or studies statistics. Prioritize. Verb. To arrange or list a group of things in order of priority or importance. Cart. Noun. A small. Open. Wheeled vehicle. Drawn or pushed by a person or animal. More often used for transporting goods than passengers. Verb. To carry goods. Baffled. Verb. To publicly disgrace. Especially of a recreant knight. Adjective. Thoroughly confused. Puzzled. Piano. Noun. A percussive keyboard musical instrument. Usually ranging over seven octaves. With white and black colored keys. Played by pressing these keys. Causing hammers to strike strings. Adjective. Soft. Quiet. Sleep. Verb. To rest in a state of reduced consciousness. Damaged. Verb. To impair the soundness. Goodness. Or value of. To harm or cause destruction. Adjective. Suffered a damage. Monitor. Noun. Someone who watches over something. Character. Noun. A being involved in the action of a story. Verb. To write. Using characters. To describe. 
discussing verb to converse or debate concerning a particular topic deputy noun one appointed as the substitute of another and empowered to act for them in their name or their behalf a substitute in office verb to deputize grandson noun a son of one's child bills noun any of various bladed or pointed hand weapons originally designating an anglo-saxon sword and later a weapon of infantry especially in the 14th and 15th centuries commonly consisting of a broad heavy double-edged hook-shaped blade with a short pike at the back and another at the top attached to the end of a long staff verb to dig chop etc with a bill noun the beak of a bird especially when small or flattish sometimes also used with reference to a platypus turtle or other animal verb to peck noun a written list or inventory now obsolete except in specific senses or set phrases bill of lading bill of goods etc verb to advertise by a bill or public notice noun the bell or boom of the bittern door noun a portal of entry into a building room or vehicle consisting of a rigid plane movable on a hinge doors are frequently made of wood or metal may have a handle to help open and close a latch to hold the door closed and a lock that ensures the door cannot be opened without the key verb to cause a collision by opening the door of a vehicle in front of an oncoming cyclist or pedestrian prices noun the cost required to gain possession of something verb to determine the monetary value of an item to put a price on blush noun an act of blushing a red glow on the face caused by shame modesty etc verb to become red in the face and sometimes experience an associated feeling of warmth especially due to shyness shame excitement or embarrassment adding verb to join or unite e.g one thing to another or as several particulars so as to increase the number augment the quantity or enlarge the magnitude or so as to form into one aggregate reporter noun someone or something that reports resolve noun determination will power verb to find a solution to a problem contain verb to hold inside practiced adjective skillful proficient knowledgeable or expert as a result of practice verb to repeat an activity as a way of improving one's skill in that activity gold noun a heavy yellow elemental metal of great value with atomic number 79 and symbol o verb to pyrolyze or burn food until the color begins to change to a light brown but not as dark as browning adjective made of gold numbered verb to label items with numbers to assign numbers to items consuming verb to use up noun consumption the process by which something is consumed adjective holding one's attention or interest loaded verb to put a load on or in a means of conveyance or a place of storage adjective burdened by some heavy load packed hopefully adverb in a hopeful manner earliest adjective at a time in advance of the usual or expected event adverb at a time before expected sooner than usual migration noun an instance of moving to live in another place for a while guys noun an effigy of a man burned on a bonfire on the anniversary of the gunpowder plot the 5th of november verb to exhibit an effigy of guy fox around the 5th of november noun a guide a leader or conductor verb to equip with a support cable optional noun something that is not compulsory especially part of an academic course adjective not compulsory left to personal choice elective gluten 
Noun, fibrin, formerly considered as one of the animal humors. A line, verb, to form a line, to fall into line. Row, noun, a line of objects, often regularly spaced, such as seats in a theater, vegetable plants in a garden, etc. Respective, adjective, relating to particular persons or things, each to each, particular, own. Loud. Noun. A loud sound or part of a sound. Adjective. Of a sound. Of great intensity. Previous. Noun. An existing criminal record. Short for. Previous convictions. Adjective. Prior. Occurring before something else. Either in time or order. Booked. Verb. To reserve. Something. For future use. Intern. Noun. A person who is intern forcibly or voluntarily. Verb. To imprison somebody. Usually without trial. Adjective. Internal. Freeway. Noun. A road designed for safe. High-speed operation of motor vehicles through the elimination of at-grade intersections. Usually divided and having at least two lanes in each direction. A dual carriageway with no at-grade crossings. A motorway. Programs. Noun. A set of structured activities. Verb. To enter a program or other instructions into a computer or other electronic device. To instruct it to do a particular task. Faint. Noun. The act of fainting. Syncope. Adjective. Of a being. Lacking strength. Weak. Languid. Inclined to lose consciousness. Accountable. Adjective. Obliged. When called upon, to answer, for one's deeds, answerable. Cucumbers. Noun. A vine in the gourd family, Cucumis sativus. Soldier. Noun. A member of an army, of any rank. Verb. To continue steadfast, to keep striving. Maid. Noun. A grub or maggot. Crucial. Adjective. Essential or decisive for determining the outcome or future of something. Extremely important. Cons. Noun. A disadvantage of something. Especially when contrasted with its advantages. Pros. Noun. A convicted criminal. A convict. Noun. A fraud. Something carried out with the intention of deceiving. Usually for personal. Often illegal. Gain. Noun. An organized gathering such as a convention. Conference or congress. Noun. The conversion of part of a building. Chapter. Noun. Authorship. One of the main sections into which the text of a book is divided. Verb. To divide into chapters. Joined. Verb. To connect or combine into one. To put together. Prescriptions. Noun. The act of prescribing a rule, law, etc. Helped. Verb. To provide assistance to someone or something. Author. Noun. The originator or creator of a work. Especially of a literary composition. Verb. Sometimes proscribed. To create a work as its author. Directions. Noun. A theoretical line. Physically or mentally. Followed from a point of origin or towards a destination. May be relative. E.g. up. Left. Outbound. Dorsal. Geographical. E.g. north. Rotational. E.g. clockwise. Or with respect to an object or location. E.g. toward Boston. Noun. Instructions for how to reach a destination or how to do something. Bullet. Noun. A projectile. Usually of metal. Shot from a gun at high speed. Verb. To draw attention to. Text. By. Or as if by. Placing a graphic bullet in front of it. Do without. Verb. Usually transitive. To manage despite the lack of. Guilds. Noun. A group or association mainly of tradespeople made up of merchants. Craftspeople. Or artisans for mutual aid. Particularly in the Middle Ages. Criticize. Verb. To find fault. With something. Repairman. Noun. A man whose job is to repair things. Schematics. Noun. A simplified line drawing used by scientists. Engineers. 
technologists and others to illustrate a system at an abstract level. Schematic drawings often use standard symbols for clarity. Charity. Noun, an organization, the objective of which is to carry out a charitable purpose. Purchasing. Verb. To buy. Obtain by payment of a price in money or its equivalent. Noun. An act or process of making a purchase. Spreadsheet. Noun. A sheet of paper. Marked with a grid. In which financial data is recorded and totals calculated manually. Verb. To model or compute by means of a spreadsheet. Fist. Noun. A hand with the fingers clenched or curled inward. Verb. To strike with the fist. Loving. Verb. Usually transitive. Sometimes intransitive. Stative. To have a strong affection for. Someone or something. Verb. To praise. Commend. Noun. The action of the verb to love. Adjective. Expressing a large amount of love to other people. Affectionate. Conductor. Noun. One who conducts or leads. A guide. A director. Locked. Verb. To become fastened in place. Adjective. Having undergone locking. Secured by a lock. Ago. Adjective. Gone. Gone by. Gone away. Past. Passed away. Adverb. Before. Simpler. Adjective. Uncomplicated. Taken by itself. With nothing added. Noun. One who grows or gathers simples. Medicinal herbs. Ruler. Noun. A. Usually rigid. Flat. Rectangular measuring or drawing device with graduations in units of measurement. A straight edge with markings. Verb. To beat with a ruler. As a traditional school punishment. 70. Numeral. The cardinal number occurring after 69 and before 71. Represented in Roman numerals as LXX and in Arabic numerals as 70. Cellar. Noun. An enclosed underground space. Often under a building. Used for storage or shelter. Verb. To store in a cellar. Chic. Noun. Good form. Style. Adjective. Elegant. Stylish. Printer. Noun. One who makes prints. Seal. Noun. A pinniped. Pinnipedia. Particularly an earless seal. True seal. Or eared seal. Verb. To hunt seals. Signing. Verb. To make a mark. Noun. The act of concluding a contract. Especially by an athlete or entertainer with a company. Drill. Noun. A tool used to remove material so as to create a hole. Typically by plunging a rotating cutting bit into a stationary workpiece. Verb. To create. A hole. By removing material with a drill. Tool. Infer. Verb. To introduce. Something. As a reasoned conclusion. To conclude by reasoning or deduction. As from premises or evidence. Detect. Verb. To discover or find by careful search, examination, or probing. Adjective. Detected. German. Noun. A near relative. Adjective. Having the same mother and father. A full. Brother or sister. Resist. Noun. A protective coating or covering. Verb. To attempt to counter the actions or effects of. Bloom. Noun. A blossom. The flower of a plant. An expanded bud. Calculated. Verb. To determine the value of something or the solution to something by a mathematical process. Adjective. Arrived at or determined by mathematical calculation. Ascertained mathematically. Smoothies. Noun. A smooth talking person. Belief. Noun. Mental acceptance of a claim as true. Decorating. Verb. To furnish with decorations. Noun. Decoration. Get off. Verb. To move from being on top of something to not being on top of it. Glazier. Noun. One who glazes. A craftsman who works with glass, fitting windows, etc. Add up. Verb. To take a sum. Devices. Noun. Any piece of equipment made for a particular purpose. Especially a mechanical or electrical one. 
parallelized verb to make parallel to each other gel noun a semi-solid to almost solid colloid of a solid and a liquid such as jelly cheese or opal verb to apply cosmetic gel to the hair etc auto noun an automobile verb to travel by automobile adjective capable of operating without external control or intervention challenge noun a confrontation a dare verb to invite someone to take part in a competition represented verb to present again or anew to present by means of something standing in the place of to exhibit the counterpart or image of to typify draw up verb to compose a document especially following a standard form lower adjective situated close to or even below the ground or another normal reference plane not high or lofty adverb close to the ground verb to let descend by its own weight as something suspended to let down clock noun an instrument used to measure or keep track of time a non-portable timepiece verb to measure the duration of going verb to move noun a departure adjective likely to continue viable garbage noun food waste material of any kind verb to eviscerate adjective bad crap shitty dollars noun official designation for currency in some parts of the world including canada the united states australia new zealand hong kong and elsewhere its symbol is dollar imports noun something brought in from an exterior source especially for sale or trade verb to bring something in from a foreign country especially for sale or trade verb to be important to be significant to be of consequence onions noun a monocotyledonous plant allium sepa allied to garlic used as vegetable and spice overcome noun the burden or recurring theme in a song verb to surmount a physical or abstract obstacle to prevail over to get the better of steal noun the act of stealing verb to take illegally or without the owner's permission something owned by someone else darkness noun the state of being dark lack of light artists noun a person who creates art loved verb usually transitive sometimes intransitive stative to have a strong affection for someone or something verb to praise commend adjective being the object of love diabetes noun diabetes insipidus any condition characterized by excessive or incontinent urine now specifically as caused by impaired production of or response to the antidiuretic hormone vasopressin counselor noun a professional who counsels people especially on personal problems measurement noun the act of measuring specification noun an explicit set of requirements to be satisfied by a material product or service cheap noun trade traffic chaffer chaffering verb to trade traffic bargain chaffer ask the price of goods cheapen goods adjective low and or reduced in price adverb cheaply cars noun a wheeled vehicle that moves independently with at least three wheels powered mechanically steered by a driver and mostly for personal transportation noun a turn noun the first part of a cons in lisp the first element of a list parent noun one of the two persons from whom one is immediately biologically descended a mother or father verb to act as parent to raise or rear skillet noun a pan for frying generally large and heavy verb to cook in a skillet crunch noun a noisy crackling sound 
the sound usually associated with crunching. Verb. To crush something. Especially food. With a noisy crackling sound. God. Noun. A being such as a monotheistic god. A single divine creator and ruler of the universe. Proper noun. The single deity of various monotheistic religions. Especially the deity of Judaism. Christianity. And Islam. Noun. A deity or supreme being. A supernatural. Typically immortal. Being with superior powers. To which personhood is attributed. Verb. To idolize. Salon. Noun. A large room, especially one used to receive and entertain guests. Signs. Noun. Sometimes also used uncountably, a visible indication. Verb. To make a mark. Hero. Noun. Somebody who possesses great bravery and carries out extraordinary or noble deeds. Head. Noun. The part of the body of an animal or human which contains the brain. Mouth and main sense organs. Verb. To be in command of. See also head up. Adjective. Of. Relating to. Or intended for the head. Miracle. Noun. An event that appears inexplicable by the laws of nature and so is held to be supernatural in origin. Verb. To affect by a miracle. To work a miracle upon. Pretend. Verb. To claim. To allege. Especially when falsely or as a form of deliberate deception. Adjective. Not really what it is represented as being. Imaginary. Feigned. Lever. Noun. Except in generalized senses below. A crowbar. Verb. To move with a lever. Deliberately. Adverb. Intentionally, or after deliberation. Not accidentally. RSVP. Verb. To reply to an invitation. Verb. Restaurants. Events. To reserve a place. Below. Adverb. In a lower place. Preposition. Lower in spatial position than. Similar. Noun. That which is similar to. Or resembles. Something else. As in quality. Form. Etc. Adjective. Having traits or characteristics in common. Alike. Comparable. Refrigerator. Noun. A household appliance used for keeping food fresh by refrigeration. Short form fridge. Drama. Noun. A composition. Normally in prose. Telling a story and intended to be represented by actors impersonating the characters and speaking. The dialogue. Airport. Noun. An airfield. An area designated for the takeoff and landing of aircraft. Including one or more runways in. For commercial airports. One or more passenger terminals. Disturbed. Verb. To confuse a quiet. Constant state or a calm. Continuous flow. In particular. Thoughts. Actions or liquids. Adjective. Showing symptoms of mental illness. Severe psychosis. Or neurosis. Review. Noun. A second or subsequent reading of a text or artifact in an attempt to gain new insights. Verb. To survey. To look broadly over. Leaf. Noun. The usually green and flat organ that represents the most prominent feature of most vegetative. Plants. Verb. To produce leaves. Put forth foliage. Evaluation. Noun. An assessment such as an annual personnel performance review used as the basis for a salary increase or bonus, or a summary of a particular situation. Data. Noun. Plural. Data. A measurement of something on a scale understood by both the recorder, a person or device, and the reader, another person or device. The scale is arbitrarily defined, such as from 1 to 10 by 1s. 1 to 100 by 0.1. Or simply true or false. On or off. Yes. No. Or maybe. Etc. Dumped. Verb. To release. Especially in large quantities in chaotic manner.